number 15, Headless. We've all heard of the Headless Horseman, but have you heard of the Headless Errand Boy? Published to YouTube in February of 2020, this clip will have you doing a double take. The clip shows what appears to be a man without a head in Asia carrying a shopping bag as if just running some errands. He walks out into traffic and slides between two cars to cross the street. No one around seems to notice the oddity. The fact that he's without a head phases no one. The car he cuts in front of even beeps loudly, just hurrying him to get out of their way. So are our eyes deceiving us? Or is this just some fancy edit? This one has me scratching my head. Number 14. Going Golfing There's nothing like Russian dash cam videos. They're usually next level crazy. This video clip is no different. A red Volkswagen is seen cutting off the driver with the dash cam and another car in front of him. So when they reach a red light, the driver decides to rev his engine and pass the Volkswagen. Big mistake. After they pass him, the Volkswagen speeds up again to pull around the driver and cuts him off, blocking his way forward. Then a man dressed in black gets out of his vehicle to confront the dash cam driver. After a very brief exchange of pleasantries, the Volkswagen owner opens the trunk of his vehicle and reaches for a golf club. Apparently, the faintest confrontation in Russia on the road can lead to brutal results, of your vehicle at least. Things have been known to quickly escalate on the Russian roads. Number 13. Human or Paranormal When you aren't sure if your imagination is playing tricks on you, post to Reddit to get another perspective. That's what this group of friends did after experiencing this strange happening. Posted by Dro to the Chills Narrator subreddit, the uploader says that while filming his friend playing guitar at his house, they heard something pound at the door. What's that? Wondering what it was, they decided to pursue it. After leaving their room, they spot something dark peeking around the corner at the end of the hallway. It darts out of sight as the boys chase after it, turning the corner and up some stairs to the open doors that leads outside. Once out there, they call after Toby, the pet dog that accompanied them. When from behind a garbage can, a ball rolls into view, thrust by a creature's arm. Toby. Run! They race off back inside. The Redditor asks, Is this someone that broke into the house or is it paranormal? Let's see what Reddit thinks. The lovely Raven313 writes, Either way, this video sent a spine-tingling sensation down my spine and I wouldn't want to be anywhere near that house. Redditor Cheery B says, This is a terrifying situation, writing. I can't really point out that anything looks specifically paranormal, although the glowing in the middle of what looks like their head, when now they were at the top of the stairs, was interesting. Others warn the dudes to get out of there now. Paranormal or not, they should probably heed that warning either way. Number 12. Attempted Entering Sometimes you're not safe even inside your locked home. This video proves it. In June of 2018, two separate ring doorbells caught a woman trying to enter into Denver area homes. While several of the enterings were only attempts, one was successful. At 4 a.m., the unlucky homeowner, fast asleep along with his wife and two sons, said that he heard his back door open and after slowly walking, jumped into action. He launched downstairs, shouting if there was anyone down there, and he came upon the culprit in action, racing from the living room to the front door. The next-door neighbor managed to capture her red-handed, but to his surprise, not only did the ring video capture the woman at the neighbor's house, but it caught her attempted entering of his own home too. As it turns out, the culprit wasn't done. The following day, another nearby neighbor caught the brazen woman on his ring security camera, also trying to enter. It is very scary that she came back to the same street that next night, the homeowner said. She allegedly made off with the family heirlooms and his wife's wedding ring. 
The family's sense of security is their greatest loss, however. Almost a week later, it's hard to sleep at night. We feel violated as a family, the homeowner said. Will you be able to sleep tonight? Number 11. Shadow Ghost Oftentimes, we see movements out of the corner of our eye, and we think we're imagining things. What if we aren't? Posted to the Ghosts subreddit by Kid Blast Double, this clip got Redditors up in arms. The video shows someone entering their backyard with their dog, but check out the fence beyond. A shadow figure can clearly be seen fleeting across the yard. It arrives behind the tree and doesn't move beyond. Apart from slightly peeking from around the tree, which can be seen on the close-up of the clip, the top comment was from Redditor Dads for Sons, who said he'd watched the clip on repeat a million times, and his first reaction was, Whoa, the slow mo gives him the chills, he says. In response, Redditor Paul VS88 points out that the OP, Big Pappy Thunder, said, Honestly, didn't think anyone would get it, or that it would somehow get nearly 7,000 upvotes, but here we are. Figured I'd bamboozle maybe five people, then take it down for a laugh. Redditors with a sense of humor had a laugh about about it. Tactius Kilgore writes, The shadow people have him and are in control of his Reddit account. There was one oddity in the video that was unedited, however, the thing peeking, but Thunder thinks that it was more likely a light from far away or from the yard behind than the shadow ghost that he'd edited into the footage. Still, this video will likely have you second guessing the next thing you see out of the corner of your eye. Number 10. Phantasma. For most ghost investigators, their only tool is their camera. These men, however, had other plans. Published to YouTube by Luan Mendez in December of 2019, this footage claims to capture the ghost of the girl in white. In the video, two men enter an abandoned house at night, calling out for the girl in white to reveal herself. The home and its surroundings seem empty at first, but as they wander around the house in search of the phantom, of course they find exactly what they were looking for. The first sighting of the girl in white is caught outside the home. They turn towards the doorway and, out in the field, the dark-haired figure dressed in a white t-shirt is standing at a distance. They scream in fear and rush towards the other side of the house. Lon manages to scrape his leg in the process. They return to the doorway where they saw the girl in white, but she's disappeared. Exploring the space more, they decide to enter a space under the home where the floorboards are missing. When one of the crew is down there, he captures the girl in white yet again, standing in the corner of the room above. <laughs> The other guy who's on the top floor hears his friend's cries and captures the door to the room closing at the same time. They both race outside to see if the girl in white exits the building, but she is nowhere to be found. However, when they return to investigate the room, the door starts to slam repeatedly. <laughs> This is the last straw for the investigators as they race outside and across the field, far away from the haunted place. Who can blame them? Number 9. Sky Fusion Buckle your seatbelts. Posted to the Chills Narrator subreddit, this video is apparently forbidden in most countries, and it's clear why. The footage shows two lit up objects in the sky. They're both moving slightly, with one of them moving a bit faster than the other and in different directions. The lights blink as the unidentified flying device on the bottom moves up towards the one above it. Suddenly, they fuse and it sends a shockwave through the sky, like a bolt of lightning. What in the heck just happened here? The uploader stumbled across the freaky forbidden video in the summer of 2018. Some think it's most likely a clip from an indie movie. Redditor the Lovely Raven 313 points out, if this actually happened, the media would be on it. Many agree with this sentiment, while some are willing to suspend their disbelief. When asked what it is, the Redditor admits he doesn't know. That's why I'm posting this to try and solve the mystery, he writes. Can you solve the mystery? I'm at a loss here. 
Number eight, Phantom in the Cupboard. Have you ever come across a video so scary that you don't want to inflict that feeling of impending doom on others? This video was posted by Hirsch Duchy to the Chills Narrator subreddit. The Redditor asks for some help in discerning what's happening here. Duchy is in an abandoned house that's littered with junk. While wandering around the space, he arrives at the kitchen. You can see the cupboard door is slightly ajar. A moment later, it opens wider on its own. The Redditor said he didn't notice this strange event at the moment. It was only when he was showing his mother the video later that he realized something unseen might have been in the house with him. Well, Duchy asked for help explaining this, and plenty of Redditors rose to the occasion. Many in the comments of this clip suggest that the wind and the open door were involved, noting that you can hear the wind and see the plants moving outside. Nails or anything like that. The Redditor agrees that it's probably the wind, but wanted to see what others thought, whether or not there may be a paranormal theory. He also notes that the wind wasn't blowing in the direction to open the door. Redditor Kaliana78, however, appears to disagree with the others writing. If it were the wind that blew that open, why wasn't all the junk blowing around as well? What do you think? Is this just another episode of wind and air streams causing movements in inanimate objects? Or is there something seriously dark going on in this house? Number 7. Clown at the Door Hardly anyone wants to see a clown at the best of times. Guaranteed, no one wants to see an uninvited clown on their doorstep. Published to YouTube in August of 2019, this creepy clown is everyone's unwelcome guest. Residents of San Antonio, Texas, likely double-check their locks after video of this creepy visitor was captured on ring surveillance footage. The clown was said to be loitering outside people's homes in the middle of the day saying trick or treat. Again, it was August at the time. The ring footage captures the man wearing a clown mask approaching a home around 1 p.m. The anonymous homeowner wasn't present at the time of the clown's visit. The security video was shared to neighborhood groups, sending a collective chill down everyone's spine. Resident Ernest Marquez sums up the fear saying, What his intentions were, I don't know. The uncertainty, the unknown is everyone's greatest fear. Hopefully this case was broken before it was too late. Number 6. Abandoned Church The following was submitted to the Chills Narrator subreddit by Urban Ghost Hunters 901 While filming B-roll in an abandoned church for a future overnight investigation, he caught something frightening on camera. One camera was in a fixed place, capturing a steady shot of a book set on a railing, surrounded by lit candles, while the cameraman was behind the other camera, filming the rest of the room. You can hear the book hit the ground loudly in both shots, while the steady cam captures its fall. <laughs> Nothing visible pushed the book or caused it to fall to the floor. In the comments, Urban explains in a more detail what happened. I was going to do a pan up shot from the back of the church, and as I started to pan up my camera blurred, as if it were trying to focus, not saying it's paranormal because it was in low light, but as it blurred, and I was looking through the LCD display, I saw something fly right in front of me. Seems like something paranormal had arrived. When you play with the paranormal, you're bound to get burned. Think it's probably time to get out of there. Number 5. Peering in What would you do if your security camera caught someone or something poking its head inside your home? Posted by I Like Chia Seats to the Ghost subreddit. The Redditor states that their neighbor lives alone and that sensor light kept flicking on and off during the night. But as it would turn off, the sensors weren't just glitching out, they were sensing someone who wasn't supposed to be there. The footage shows someone peering into the home, wearing a mask of some sort. Redditor Lame suggests it looks like a dude wearing a mask, a hoodie, and a baseball cap. Ex Julian of Norwich X responds that perhaps the stranger's cap mask combo forced him to look up to see if he'd encountered the homeowner, but when he realized it was just a motion light, he backed slowly out of the home. Others say if it was a nervous man looking to take something, 
His reaction was much too calm in response to a light turning on in the home he was about to take from. Do you agree? If that's not the case, then what is it? Number 4. Banshee Have you ever heard a banshee? Or seen one? You're about to. Posted by Omni King Arceus 2 to the Chills Narrator subreddit, the uploader claims this video may be proof of the existence of banshees. Dressed in long green dresses under grey cloaks with long hair and red eyes from constant crying, banshees appear or are heard by those whose family members or acquaintances have passed. The banshee's cry is described as mournful beyond all other sounds on earth, and when heard in the silent night, it is said to predict the passing of someone close to the listener, or may even be a warning of the person's own forthcoming passing. This clip shows an Irish woman named Nicole walking from a shrieking sound outside her home. For some reason, she decides to head out into the darkness to investigate. While outside, she pauses for a moment to listen, and the haunting wailing is heard again. As she continues wandering in the darkness, she addresses whatever creature is making the noise, saying she's not there to hurt it, but to help it. Not long after, there's a shape in the darkness. You can hardly make it out, but it appears like a robed figure. Again, the shrieking noise is heard. <laughs> the frightened young woman turns to hurry back inside. In the extended version of the video, the woman explains what happened after she returned home. She said when she arrived at the back door, it was locked. She went to another back door and there was a comb on her desktop. She says she doesn't use combs. She wonders if ghosts groom themselves. What is going on here? Angela Elliott added that if you hear the banshee, then an acquaintance will pass away. And if you see one, then you will. As a matter of fact, in the clip, Nicole gets a phone call telling her that a schoolmate was found passed away. It's unleashed where my dad I glanced it and all back in a sec. I'm sorry, what? But Nicole saw the Banshee too. Will she be next? Number 3. Human vs. Ghost If you've ever wondered who would win in a battle, a human or a ghost, you're about to have your answer. This clip was posted to Facebook in March of 2020. The footage shows a semi-transparent ghost throwing rocks and other items from under a bridge. As other men enter the scene and see what's transpiring, one of them takes it upon himself to run at the ghost man and confront him. After a struggle with the man, the ghost comes out ahead. Many more men join in before the ghost man escapes and assumedly glides off to his ghost den. What's happening here? What did this ghost possibly want? This story needs a follow-up. Number 2. Ghost Footprints if you encountered ghost footprints at your workplace, would you be able to continue working there as though nothing happened? Published to YouTube by Korean channel Saiwon Yoon in April of 2020, the uploader writes, The footprints of ghosts caught by the CCTV in the recording studio. The surveillance footage shows a recording studio at night. After capturing an odd glitch on camera in a certain area of the studio, which the uploader notes look like footprints, the crew sets up some paranormal sensors to see whether or not any spirit activity exists in the room. As you can see, the sensors are blowing up. They indicate something is moving in the darkness. Imagine sensing a paranormal presence in the studio, something you cannot see with the human eye, and then having that presence confirmed via these sensors. The idea certainly disturbs some sound technicians. YouTuber High and Sick Woo wrote in the comments, I was also surprised when I watched the video. I can't broadcast alone. I can't go to the studio at night. Would you be able to after seeing this? Because this footage appears real to me. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because we upload a new scary video every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. Unknown Siren 
There's nothing more disturbing than the sound of an unexpected and unknown siren. What could possibly be impending? A tornado tearing through the town? What are we being warned about? Posted by Epic Memer Boy 0123 to the Chills Narrator subreddit, the uploader writes that he started to hear sirens randomly midday. In the clip, the sirens sound quite high pitched, almost like a car horn beeping long and restlessly. Several in the comments suggest it's a test siren of some kind, either for tornado warnings or other emergencies. The Redditor clarifies that it lasted for around 10 to 15 minutes. Superman Connor writes, That definitely sounds too long to be a tornado siren then. When the Redditor mentions that a friend said it was an air raid siren, Superman responds those only last about 30 seconds. It seems the Redditor isn't the only one suffering from unknown siren syndrome. The Wastelander 96 writes, Something similar happened near here a couple nights ago, when the sirens just went off for like 10 to 15 minutes and then just stopped. Perhaps it is an emergency siren that they are testing, but for a different kind of emergency. Wonder what that could be? Thanks for checking out this video. Be sure to subscribe because we upload new countdowns every Tuesday and Saturday. Or if you're still not convinced, here are some of our other videos that I think you'd like. Enjoy!